Hello and welcome back with me, Admon. Joining me back on Star Wars and Galaxy of Heroes. So, uh, we're gonna, I'm just going to show you a few bits and bobs. We're going to do a few bit, little bits and bobs uh, in this episode. Just my daily stuff to get rid of these request stuff. So, you've got your dailies, which I'm obviously in the middle of doing. Um, you've got... So, you get them all the time. And then you get refresh bonus energy and stuff like that. That's just these two. Um, so, you get them and then obviously you get... Oh, I'll quickly show you actually. Then you get obviously achievements, which currently pretty much just unlocks Darth Vader. Uh, I've got 65 out of 80 so far. I've still got a fair ways to go. Level 50 is pretty, pretty much going to be my level, my turning point. Level 43 at the moment, as you can see. But what we're going to do is going to go to events and we're just going to do this fair door, first order event, battle list. You get preset this one, so you can't choose your characters, so it just presets it for you. Um, so we're just going to do that. And then it does tell you what to do because this is like, it's trying to teach you how to do certain things within the game. Uh, but later on, it does just let you do whatever you want to do, however you want to do it. And it's not so bad. Uh, so let's just let's just uh, kill this guy. I mean, there's no point. Uh, yeah, yeah, it shouldn't take too much, to be fair, to, to do this. Let's read what the ability is. Uh, Deal physical damage to target enemy with a 70% chance of removing 50%. Yeah, go on, shot. Let's do that. Let's kill him. And then, yeah, we'll just get rid of um, the little BB-8. Just do auto this. Pretty, well, I can't auto it, but I'll just do basics all the way. Because, like I say, it doesn't take too much. First of all, it starts quite easy, and then, it obviously, progressively gets harder. As you can see, I can do the next one. Uh, I don't know if it's going to let me jump straight in. It is. Good. So, we'll do the next one as well. Uh, yeah, like I say, it's going to tell you how to do stuff. So, arm is up, and then we'll just uh, kick their ass, I guess. <laughs> Pow! Right in the face! Right, what, what does he say? What's he telling us to do? Just finish them off. All right, let's, uh, pow! Shoot him in the face! Go! Let's just kill this guy, and then we'll, we'll get Ray at the end. We should have probably targeted Ray first, but never mind. The, the AI thinks we should have targeted him first, so that's fine. We'll go with that one. Kill her off. And uh, I don't know if we're going to be able to do the next round because it does stop at a certain point, but I, I don't know. We might be able to. Uh, yeah, we can. We can probably go all the way to tier three, actually, uh, as it looks. It's just not too bad. Uh, as as I say, it is going to progressively get harder, though, so it, it should get harder throughout these entire stages. Uh, I don't think we win anything. This is just like a basic training sort of area. So, uh, you, you, like I say, you can't can't win anything. Let's uh, let's do that. We're getting loads of uh, let's armor up straight away, and then we'll uh, all of them, and then shoot him in the face, and then shoot him in the face again. <laughs> Should kill him. Ah, oh, just do a basic then. And then we'll target Ray, and then we'll do do the big one with Ray. Uh, if we get Kylo Ren back up, and we'll shoot him in the face again, and then we'll kill her off. Hopefully, yeah, and then we'll shoot him in the face, and then we'll do some slicey slicey, shoot him in the face again, and then we'll just basic this until the end. Like I say, it's it's not overly difficult. These, they, like I said, we'll get to the rounds where they get more difficult. Eventually, we'll finish this off, uh, and then it'll restart. It's well, it should restart then, and then it'll progress through uh, some of the uh, the more difficult stuff then. So shoot him in the face. Uh, we'll shoot him in the face. That probably no, it hasn't killed them, but that well off. Okie dokie. Then we'll, kill, we'll get all of them, slice them up, armor up with the uh, the obviously the what did they call first order stormtrooper, and then shoot her in the face, which will kill her off. And then we've got a couple of different ones. So we've got pinning shots, so it deals physical damage and removes fifty centimeters. So yeah, why not? Let's use that. And then we'll slice them up, and then slice them up again, and shoot them with all the extra buffs that we again kill them. There we go. Uh, probably target BB-8 at this point, because why not? We'll target, yeah. Uh, we'll go for you. Get an advantage, and then boom! Yeah. How'd you like them apples? Shoot them up, and then, yeah, we'll just kill them off now. Uh, we've got armor just in case, and then we'll just finish. We'll finish up. Should kill them. There we go. Pretty straightforward, these ones. Like I say, we'll get on. I think you unlock, obviously, like, they they the prints or the sh whatever you want to call them shards prints uh, whatever you want to call them that you unlock them every time you complete these types of battles so it's actually very 
very good to do so. They say tell you can win it's all random though. So you could got you could have got like as many as you like from any of the characters that you've just played. So it's completely random, uh, which is kind of cool. I did complete Galaxy World this morning. Uh, so that needs to reset in 13 hours and 50 minutes. So that is completed for today. Uh, I'll probably be able to do it again tonight. But we got all, we, we like I say, we completed all, all. Uh, how many rounds is it? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 rounds. We completed all 12, got the 1200 that we require. Uh, because we need to get Zeb. Uh, which obviously uses them. So we unlocked them. And then we're going to get them again later. In, in Well, in just under two hours. We'll get them again. Which will get them actually to four star. Which is ideal. Apparently, if you do that for 12 or 11 days solid. Which I've done now for two. I've done that three times now, I believe. Or twice or three times. I think it's three times. Uh, but if you do it for... If you do it 11 days solid. Uh, then apparently you can tier uh, or star seven zeb which will be ideal uh looking at some of my characters so far so we've got everyone up to well all the main characters up to level 43 which is obviously my level so all the main ones that i use which is obviously the phoenix crew at the moment uh, i have all the phoenix crew now Kanan's is the only one that is more difficult to obtain just because i need to do the squad battles and the squad battles are starting to become a little bit harder because everyone's caring for the phoenix god the only difference is, is they seem to have four star canons and four star zebs uh, as well so they seem to be they seem to be doing me over a little bit just because they are a little bit stronger so that may take a little time just to get canons ones up but i only need one more so hopefully if i finish in the top uh well i'm currently sat at I think it's just over 2,000. I, if I can get below 2,000 today, which my, that is my plan, I should be able to get about 300 uh, today, which means I can get him to free star today as well. And then Count Dooku, we will we are working on it at some point. We did unlock Grand Moff Tarkin, um, and we got Fight the Pilot up to tier 4 as well. Like I say, these are all free shards, so I, I didn't see why I wouldn't upgrade them, because it was all free. Uh, store should be a free token. Yeah, good. So get your free. Don't forget to claim your free stuff if you are playing the game. Uh, these tokens as well. If you are new to the game, I highly doubt you are because the game's been out for ages. But and, and if you're watching me, especially, if, but if you are new, to, like you've come from Star Trek that I normally play, uh, then don't forget to just use these. Just get rid of them. These. This is the only thing that you can use them for. Uh, it seems so far. So uh, just use them up. Uh, just get because you can get characters. You can unlock certain characters. Um, you have a chance, obviously, and obviously you get a lot of equipment as well. Um, so it's possible, uh, and you can obviously get some of these characters as well uh, if you're very, very lucky, uh, which would be very nice, but it is what it is. Uh, what else can we do today? Can we got any challenges today? Uh, no, but we got that, so we'll finish that. Get some credits. We got this one. We need to freestyle this. Um which is a bit of a pain in the arse, to be honest, because my crew isn't very good. Uh, my weakest link seems to be my Jedi Consulate, but we'll see if we can keep him alive this time. Uh, I'm not sure if we're going to be able to, but we'll see if we can keep him alive. Um, we got, we're got. we just going to use basics mostly for these first ones, uh, just because they don't really need like the, big, the better abilities. That's more later on when we go against Savage Press. Um, we can debuff her, to be fair, uh, which would help going into the next round, but it doesn't really make a difference. Uh, again, with this round, as long as you target the right one, so you target the back two before you target the front two, because the back two are attackers, whereas the front two are... We can use that. The front two are um, just tanks, so their 10 meters is really, really slow. So if we can get rid of the back two, then that would be beneficial. Should be them off. Yeah, there we go. He's going to stealth up, but that makes no difference to us. Uh, let's just kill them off with uh, some auto. Well, not auto, but some basic maneuvers. Uh, it shouldn't take too long. There we go. And then everything, hopefully, is reset for this round. Because what we need to do is we need to hit him hard and hit him like, really hard, really fast. Um, let's go for that. <coughs> get see because that is what we are avoiding uh so we're going to give that to our uh constant there we go and then we're going to just get rid of there 
We're going to heal up if we can. Uh, yeah. And then we need to try and get him down as quickly as possible now. Uh, because he is going to basically tear us apart. If he gets another one of them abilities. So let's... I should have probably used the thing there. But never mind. But we need to get him down as quick. Hopefully he doesn't die. I'm hoping he doesn't. Because if he does then we only get two star. Which is a bit of a pain in the arse. Um, but we need to get him down before. Get everyone healed up again. If we... Hopefully we can... Like I say before his ability. Thank God. There we go. So we free start that. So we critted him at the end, which is why we won that. But now what it means is we can just sim it every time now and we don't need to actually physically battle it unless we run out of sim tokens, which is looking to be the case like a gunner because we only have nine. Uh, but apparently level 50 onwards, um, that is no longer so much an issue. Uh, and it is different days. So, for example, uh, this these two events... Uh, well, that one's slightly different, but this event is Sunday, Monday, Thursday. This event is Sunday, Wednesday, and Saturday. So this event will be tomorrow. Good thing about this is you get all the different upgrade tokens, uh, which is allows you to upgrade all the different stuff. Uh, we'll have to do the, obviously, the window uh, event tomorrow as well, which you can get, obviously, loads of different equipment, uh, which is pretty handy. And you get crystals as well, which is these. These are like your special things that you can buy to obviously help you progress further and stuff like that. The only thing I'm going to be doing today now really is, um, well, I'm going to upgrade anyone's equipment that I can upgrade, like Chopper, for example. We need to get him to tier 5 ideally. And we are trying to upgrade Zeb and uh, Kanan to all gear to also tier 5. But we'll go with Chopper for now uh, since he is better than them two, it seems, um, as as the moment. Uh, we nearly have, obviously, Ezra Bridget to a five star. We just need to get nine more of him. And then we'll work towards Hera getting her to five star as well. And then that would be a pretty good combo. Zeb will be four star by the end of today, which is good. And that is pretty much it. We are going to be working through the dark side battles. So we do need to work on our, uh, like, getting our Dooku up. Uh, and some of the dark side team because we only two starred this one last time which i'm going to go back and redo this one because i can't have a two star because that's embarrassing so yeah other than that hope you've enjoyed this video this is an insight of what this game's about uh and what you can do and it's like i say it's pretty good i'm going to be doing more of this so i'll see you next time bye bye for now